Basically, our enemies have figured out how to wage war upon us without, it's not a shooting war. My husband's a veteran, and they refer to shooting wars, and then they refer to classical Cold War subversion and tenderization of the enemy. And it's the latter that we're being attacked by. Uh, so rather than a shooting war, which is really kind of wasteful, costs a lot of money, you sacrifice your people, um, we're in a war which, uh, in the School for the Americas, they teach Americans to do this to countries overseas, and karma's a bitch. I'm not saying we deserve it, but the same techniques of subverting other democracies, taking the leaders off the chessboard, uh, creating an environment where you can't tell truth from lies, propagandizing the population, um, creating punishments, suppressing the rule of law, now that's happening to us, in, and it's happening to people around the world. The war is against the West, and the war is against democratic open societies and the rule of law. And um, it, it's through what the CCP calls asymmetrical warfare, where, again, no shots are fired, but our institutions are being uh, subverted and dissolved. Our cultural norms are being subverted and dissolved. Our right to touch each other, and I'll get to that, is being destroyed um, by fiat. And I, I have a theory about why this is happening, and I'll, I'll speak to it if you want me to.